Hi, I'm Dr. Moshe Roth. I practice at Family Eye Care in Oak Ridge, New Jersey. A traumatic brain injury breaks the visual system and self-esteem. A traumatic brain injury, or a TBI, often breaks the vital communication between the brain and the visual system. And this brings on disabling symptoms. People often have symptoms of blurred vision, or double vision, or difficulty reading, and dizziness. Individuals may then feel anxious or depressed and have low self-esteem. When somebody suffers a brain injury due to a car crash, a concussion, or a stroke, they may no longer be able to do things that they were able to do before. They may have recurring headaches that require the individual to take breaks frequently when working or studying or reading. They may have chronic dizziness and then that can lead to difficulty in driving or making the individual dependent on others. A child that has suffered a TBI or a concussion may not be able to play group sports or activities. They may then feel alone or different. That's where we come in. If you have a loved one that suffered even a mild tra traumatic brain injury, please feel free to visit our office. We can often help. We begin with a comprehensive eye examination and a functional vision evaluation to determine what specific course of neuroptometric rehabilitation will, 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 we will need to use in order to help you. A brain injury can cause double vision or eye tracking problems. Reading a book or catching a ball can then become a struggle and extremely frustrating. That then can lead someone who has suffered a brain injury to become sad, have lower self-esteem, or even become depressed. Be alert for these signs. Social withdrawal, persistent feelings of sadness, lack of interest in personal hygiene or appearance, negative self-talk like, I can't, I can't, lack of motivation, being irritable or moody, reduced appetite or lack of, ap or, or lack of appetite, and most of all, frustration. In the next video, I'm gonna talk about how a neuro optometrist can help.